hari pun eh, Apa khabar? Hai um, Pastilah baik hari ini hari buruk ke? <laughs> okay uh, First and foremost, I want to thank Zamri for giving me the chance to speak with you all today And just so you know why this whole thing is going to be in English is because of recording reasons If the camera is not there, I don't mind speaking yours as much uh, BM as possible actually So, semua boleh ya? Boleh yeah. If there's anything you do not understand, we can save it for Q&A later And I will try to speak it as simple English as possible lah. All right. Nobody likes high and English lah. Then ingat dia orang atas lah. You don't have that around here <laughs> Okay, so as somebody have told you uh, I've known him for a few years in person But honestly speaking, I heard about his name since day one actually When I learned about internet marketing So he's been around here longer than I did lah actually <laughs> How I started out was like this. Uh, body intrusive kid, huh? Yes. Okay. How I started out was like this. In 2004, that's like nine years ago, I was working nine to five. I actually more like eight to seven actually. <laughs> eight to seven, the other way around, huh? mm -hmm. right? In a in a cleaning chemical manufacturing company. How many of you are working right now? That means you are working for somebody else. Only one, two, three. Only, uh, sorry, maybe that's all. I just want to survey straight up. I want to see how many of you. One, two, three, four. Feels like 50% of you. How about the others? Working for yourself or what? Okay, separate your milik business internet sekarang. Oh, okay. About, say more like 35% of you. Okay. How many of you are making some money right now? That means, that means, a few, okay, definition of some money is a few hundred ringgit a month minimum. A few hundred ringgit a month. Okay. <laughs> Whoa, I don't want ties in here. <laughs> good, good. How about the rest of you? Not making any money. Uh, this is not a, a humiliation call or whatever. I, I just want to be honest with you and you be honest with me. Because uh, how you respond to me is how I will structure the presentation for you all. Because I'm not going to just click the slide and tell you right from the slide kalau macam itu, I just send your email lah correct you see, uh, this is what, this is what your, 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 your present, your your event, not, not so much about mine in me, I prefer to stay home lah actually <laughs> betul alright so okay, from what I understand that half of you are working right now the other half of you are uh, on your own business and I say about 30, 30 to 35% of you are making some money right now Okay. So, nine years ago, I was like half of you. Okay, I was working for someone else, and uh, life wasn't that good, lah. <laughs> All right, I had to take the KTM from Singapore to KL Central, and then change to LRT, and then go to Kelana Jaya, the last station, and then walk another twenty minutes if it's not raining, and then I reach my workplace. I spent three hours a day just taking the train and walking. And life was very interesting. Okay, lah. You kalau mau bersikap positif, interesting lah. I'll tell you what I'm saying. I feel like the time it was it's all the the four letter word and the bad words here. That's how I feel like the time very negative. In fact, the time I had was so long. It was covering all the way down here. Okay, I normally you see all my pictures. You never see me in a long hair before. But that time, that one year, I didn't take any pictures of myself. A bit. Regret right now, but my hair is all the way here. And you know, there's a saying like for for women ah, kalau dia punya rambut macam ni dia tak cukup tujuh mata means low of self esteem, correct? Ah, low of self esteem. You see, I was low of self esteem. A lot of people see me. I walk in the KL Central, I was like all alone in my bag, walking around on my own. That was me at the time. So I worked for one full year, and I stumbled upon this possibility of starting an internet business thanks to a friend. He said. I even thought of starting an online business. I was like, no, oh, we'll see how it goes. So one day I picked up a book by, I'm sure you all know who he is, uh, Senji. No. Senji. He is the author of the longest book uh, published uh, in terms of duration, not the number of pages, uh, longest duration. How to earn US dollars in your pajamas using the internet, black and white uh, cover. I saw Zombie's name inside. So that's how I heard about him the first time before he even heard about me. Itu satu otak yang sudah lama tau. So anyways, to cut a long story short, 
Okay. I basically told my boss to you know have off. <laughs> okay, because you know, orang gila, no, so like, every time it's always very angry, and as a result, if your company, your sharika, always for people going in and out every two weeks, of, it means your company is in trouble. <laughs> Betul. Uh, okay. Betul. If you come in, the guy introduces himself two weeks later, he's very angry, and you leave the company, you know your company is in trouble already. Right? <laughs> so, but I had to stay for one year. <laughs> I considered the longest staying start that I advice. If I work somewhere else, uh, one year is nothing, but though, one year you work somewhere else, is, you're nobody, right? Here I work one year, I'm somebody. <laughs> That's how terrible the company was. So one year later, 2005, I told my boss I don't want to work for him anymore because he kept scolding me and uh, belittling me. Very crazy person. Uh, his family cannot stand him as well. Wow, so that person will Okay, but that was what really happened. So I left it. I uh, left the company, that means when you know when you quit your job means your income nil. Your income nil, huh? Exactly what happened to me. I said 4,000 ringgit at the time. And if you remember, how much was one US dollar at the time in ringgit? This was in uh, 2005. 3.8, 3.7, 3.8, 1.2 How much do you have? 1,000 How much do you have? 1,000 1,000 Wow, I love 1,000 Wow, you are very quiet crowd Ha 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 Just uh, last month I was speaking at Mind Valley Have you heard of Mind Valley? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, some of you have heard of mine very. I went there, there were 200 people, and when I climbed up the stage to speak to them, I didn't see anyone. I saw lights only. All lights. You know, like the show X Files? <laughs> when you get adopted by the alien, all lights only. So when I came up, it's called lights only. Now I see you all. Oh, I'm just playing with you all. I'm just playing with you all. Huh? 4,000 ringgit, and so that means I mean, have all. 1,000 plus plus lah, okay? This money gone in three months. <laughs> starting an online-based business. Actually, starting an online-based business doesn't cost a lot of money if you know what you're doing. Correct? Yeah. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you're holding very low, I'll sign for Okay, so that... The, but most of the, can say 80% of this money went to a lot of mistakes I did. I did a lot of uh, stupid things like uh, guarantee traffic. Or maybe I tried guarantee traffic. Oh, I don't know what I when you hear guarantee traffic, stay away from it. It's not true. Yeah. Alright? Don't ask me why. Just, just take my word for it. <laughs> it doesn't work. Okay? Those that goes like... Uh, Spend, you pay 29 US dollars and they give you 1 million traffic visitors. Nonsense, man. <laughs> it doesn't work that way. And then I also bought a CD with all the million, 1 million email names. How many of you have done that before? <laughs> wow. It's not a I know you are not Or you have a friend who did it before, that's why you laugh at him right now. <laughs> that's what I did. Okay, so very quickly, most of my money gone. So this is 2005. Uh, about half half the year, so all my most of my income was gone. Uh, so my savings were gone, no income. And what happened was that this is very desperate because I was staying in. Actually, I'm Ora Asa. I'm a PJ person, Nain Jaya. But after a series of family uh, drama, I ended up in Galapata. Oh, 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 yes. You know, if you had, if I said Galapata just uh, last year, I don't think anyone was like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> but after you know the, the campaigning, the yeah. kids and all that, suddenly Gelap Pata very famous. They put a lot of pictures of, on Facebook of Gelap Pata. I see now only you know where Gelap Pata is. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's the place I, I hang out for a few years of my life. Huh? <laughs> but I ended up there. This is, we're talking about 10 years ago, to 8 years ago. Huh? Okay? No Lim Kitsiam, no this whatever politics stuff. Very, very rural. Quite, it's quite a rural area. So, okay. Oh, speaking of rural area. No swimming, only about time net. So that means 
I started my business owner, dialogue modem. 56k dialogue modem. <laughs> Imagine paying 10 times more for 10% of the speed. <laughs> Uh, that's how frustrating it was. So I, I was very frustrated. I wanted to go back and get a job, uh, but that's a problem. Uh, you remember the boss I was telling you about that I uh, did this to him? <laughs> you know, in the in, when you're filling up for employment, right, they're going to ask you for your previous experience. Yeah. Yeah. His company was the only experience I had, you know. And can we let the, the employer, potential employer ask me, can I contact your former boss for. <laughs> 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 Yeah, so I was like, I said, yeah, you can. <laughs> but I was hoping, I, I, I was hoping they don't call up, uh, but I didn't get any job at all, uh, so I think they didn't call him. <laughs> okay, so I, I think I did it a little bit too early, like, even though I didn't like him, you see. But it happened. So since I didn't get a job, I didn't have any more uh, savings, and my mother wasn't working. My sister is still in school at the time, so. I had no choice but to go back to try my online business again, but I didn't have a lot of time actually. You see, I owe the time net a few months already, they're going to potong anytime. The electricity going to potong anytime. You, have you opened up the rain notice before? Some of you going to before, but to me it wasn't a laughing matter at the time. Okay? So, and also my mother told me, uh, actually, son, we uh, owe rent four months actually, not two months. So, uh, quite sad like those days, very depressing. So anyways, I went back to try my online business again. No buying CD whatever because, not because I was serious, but because no money. No money. <laughs> okay, so that means I got no, uh, no, no mentor, no ebooks, no 997 US dollar course, things like that. No one to guide me and no friends even. Nobody wanted to have anything to do with me. Failure, mom, sudah gagal. <laughs> Then something happened. In May 2005, for the first time I got my first sale, 97 US dollar. It came from a least suspected country. I was so excited. I ran upstairs. I woke my mother up because she had midnight. So I said, Come down, I want to show you. We made the first sale. So she's coming down. Okay, oh, <laughs> you see, we look at the sale together. <laughs> you show this money. <laughs> <laughs> Never seen what a sale like looks like before. How many of you know? Have, how many of you have made a sale before online? Have, how many of you made a sale online before? I'm sure hands. Tadi ada berapa ratus? Okay, some of you, some of you. The rest of you haven't, right? Yes. Your first sale will always be the most exciting. Yeah. You will yes. always be. Yes. Ah, ada yes yes kara. <laughs> Your first sale will always be the most exciting. And for me, it was very exciting. Even like now, I feel so. It's the best because it gives you hope that oh, you've been trying all this work. It works, you need to find out how. So, it's like back to this one. So, this is what I said, I said, I think so. I've never seen this email before. Okay, I was afraid it was spam, you know, actually. Because I started getting spam into my nonsense and all that. So, but why is this person from Africa? I thought you said your customer are Americans. I was like, yeah, I don't know, I feel for money. I didn't even know they had internet, but I know you're thinking of the. No, those savanna and all that, no, not all those. Okay, there's, 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 there's developed areas in Africa actually, but I just didn't know at the time. So that's how it started out for me. Alright? So why are we talking about continuity income? Why not uh, other topics? You know? Why not how to do affiliate marketing? Why not how to create your product? How to build this? Why are we not, why are we talking about it instead? Okay, now uh, have you all been to this session before? Yes. yes. Uh, show of hands, please. Three, four. Some of you. Okay. All right. So I do not know who the how the previous speakers uh, uh, what the topics are, and I do not know about the coming ones. I believe they will speak based on their expertise. So I have a lot of choices to tell you on what topics because I've been doing quite some time. I can talk about copywriting, uh, how to build this, how to do from scratch, but why continuity income? Uh, let me tell you why. Over the years, remember I told you I made my first sale? Yeah. Then the next question is how to make more of that? <laughs> how to make more of that? So, of course eventually I discovered that you've got to create printing products, you've got to build a list, uh, ada pacaran lagi to make money? 
So <laughs> many, Many, okay. Okay, tell you what. I'm going to just test your knowledge for, for now, okay, before I give you the answer. What other ways you can do to make money online? Sell. Physical product. Physical product. Okay, physical products. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to write here. Just throw to me. Physical products. What else? Info products. Info. Okay, info products. Service. Service. Just now you said affiliate, right? Yeah. What else? Uh, membership. Okay, I'll talk about that later, but we'll just put it here. Memberships, what other ways? Dropshipping, drop okay, dropshipping, alright. What other ways? Flipping. Hmm? Flipping. Flip what? Side flipping. Ah, side oh, side flipping. flipping. You say flipping, or online in the top. Sleeping. Okay, so, but the harami of illegal or not here. <laughs> You all do business ethical, or you do it ethically, or you only last for a while. Never put muscle and teeth out. You don't do this kind of stuff. Why? Which one of the ways? I think we can fill out this part of it. Advertising. Blogging. Okay, okay, blogging. Okay, advertising. Okay, I just put adsets for you. Adsets. Adsets. All right. What other ways you got? CPA is more of a fair thing. Okay, CPA. CPA, yes. CPA, okay, CPA. You don't know what CPA? Click for action. Cost for action. Or click for action, like you're making money. You can call it click for action also. What other ways you got? Residual income. Yes, sir. Under membership. It's under memberships. What other ways you got? You can search it. I attended a seminar uh, by Kia Becker uh, last year. The whole room was brainstorming. The speaker filled up the whole board in one. So I don't really have a smaller board. But okay, never mind, doesn't matter. Uh, there's no, no price option. or hmm? option. Option? Uh, okay, oh, ah, option, option, good. What other ways you got? Okay, now mind we stop here, but at least we know now that this is the, you see you tested your knowledge, right? So you know roughly that there are some ways you can make money online or, or, or many ways, see? Now, why, you see right, me, I'm more towards the, I have made a few ways of making money online from this, well, mostly I sell people products, I feel it. <coughs> I have a service, memberships, the rest are. So you can see that it's quite quite possible to be running multiple types of businesses, giving different avenues. Okay? So when you give different avenues, what comes back? You get different revenues of income stream. Alright? So back to where I started out, how to make more of that? One yeah. more step back. Yeah. Okay. Over the times, I kept creating more and more info products, and I realized that there was a problem with that I have to keep creating over and over again. You see, so how can I get someone to pay me over and over again? Mm -hmm. All right, and that's why I'm going to come to this in a while. I found this. I found a solution only in 2011. I tried in 2008 and 2009. Right, I made my first membership site. It took me six months with a partner. Thirty members only. I think people here are one. <laughs> okay, somewhere there, thirty six months. I think of thirty members. It's true. Never mind. Try to go back. Second side, six months again. Another partner, thirty again. <laughs> and they drop out very fast until like this whole group empty, just like that. Very frustrating. So I didn't want to try again, I gave up. I went back to what I did not create products up. And you know the problem with uh, doing it over the years? You realize that you're getting older as well. Okay, I'm still young, I'm still young. 
But you know, one day things will catch up to you and your commitment and things keep changing. Like, you know, it's not like last time. Because last time I started, I was 18 years old. 18 to 20, you just do whatever you want. Nah. Uh, up, 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 up. Those what, what a 40 year old cannot do, I can do. Yeah. But one day I'm going to be 40 years so. <laughs> old. Alright? And it's not looking smart. So I tried again in 2011. What I'm going to teach you in a while. That, and I'm going to show you my uh, test uh, experiment video. In fact, I'll let it play. I'll show you what I found at the end. Okay, so I'm going to play a YouTube video which I uploaded. This was done in 2011. Alright, I'm going to let this video play. Video log ever. And uh, this time. Hey, it's Evan here, my first video log ever. And uh, this time I just want to discuss about uh, my first successful monthly membership. Now, come on, you and this is something of recent development, and I'm just doing this rather impromptu. So I hope you'll find this useful uh, and beneficial if you're trying to do a monthly membership site yourself or you're interested in the idea of uh, creating passive income using the internet. Alright? Uh, just to let you know that this is kind of like a uh, last minute, uh, short notice kind of thing. Uh, initially I was going to do this as a blog post, but I think it's much more effective if I share this in a video format so I can actually explain to you more in a few minutes rather than you know, writing it all. Alright, so here goes. Okay, just before I go on, uh, I'm going to let you know that there's nothing to sell here, I've got nothing to pitch in, so oh, at the end of this video, <laughs> you're not going to see any like, sneaky affiliate links or, or stuff like that, okay? This is just pure content and everything I've got to share here, alright? So, just want to let you know that I first did my uh, field test for my first, what I call a hatchling membership site, in the last two weeks doing some small promotions with a handful of GV partners, and I was able to secure 150 monthly members exactly at this amount, and from the looks of it, yeah, there's been like a 20% dropout rate and a retention rate is like 80%. It converted at the average of 33% as an upsell, which means uh, what I did is that I had this front end product, okay, and then after they purchased my front end product, I actually hit them at a one time. 150, product, which is my the first time. Two, side. two times, 30. You can say that every one in three of them, I actually uh, end up going on to be my recruiter. Two and a half weeks to stay six months. All right. Oh. And it took me two and a half weeks to set that up to full completion, that means all the content is done in advance, everything totally, alright, it took me two and a half weeks from scratch. From now scratch. I know that's not uh, right, phenomenal, okay, because I'm sure if you have web sales letters or membership sites, you have people telling you they got 500, 1,000, 2,000 members and things like that, so 150 members is not impressive at all, actually, it's got plenty of room for improvement. And I'm, I'm going to be honest with you on a couple of things here, number one, up until now, I totally suck at doing monthly membership. <coughs> I, I haven't had any really really success. Good luck to it and or any success with it. Okay. Up until now, all my membership size has only, only been like uh, one off. Okay. So in 2008, I spent six months working on this monthly site, and, and you know what? It went on to make only 30 plus members, and <coughs> the members, which is really really sad. Okay. And I'm sure you agree with me. If you spend half a year working at something, and you hope you can get like hundreds of thousands of members. Uh, and you wind up getting only the lead. And I felt very discouraged. And this is why I didn't have any, uh, you know, I didn't sign any monthly membership sites after that because I was convinced it didn't work. Okay? And also, I want to expose the truth about most membership sites that you probably have heard of, right? You see, most of the marketers I actually talked to in person or email them and things like that. I, I got in the insider information, okay? The sales letters you read about people getting 1,000, 2,000 members, you know what? Most of them have to say, yeah, members stay on the average for one to three months. Maximum one three months. Right? Right? A lot of people stay three months. That's not true. Passive income. Come on. If you're getting a thousand members and they stay for only like one to three months, to me that's not you know passive income. They just drop out, you know. Right? And there's nothing really impressive about that. It's just like getting a thousand finance sales, you know. Alright? Which um, I'm sure you know, if you work your way up, you can actually get that uh, run away up that much you know. Mm -hmm. And a marketer that I know personally, he, uh, I'm not going to disclose his name here, but he has to share with me. He was able to close the deal for the needs of the first month. And you know, you can get $10,000 of money in passive income, so you don't have to work for it again. Oh, this month, $10,000 total. Next month, $100,000. Yes, one. Second month, only $900 worth of members in the state. Where did the other 90 you know, 90% go? Alright? Mm -hmm. It's dropped out. Alright? Okay. Now, so this is the other half truth that most of this uh, membership marketers are not telling you, you know? Alright? And if you're operating competitive, it's just like, you know, the internet market itself is not unusual to see people drop out after one to three months, alright? Uh, and that's really just sad, you know? And 
the, the problem about most what I call bad membership sites is that whether you have 1,000 or 100 or even 10 members, you still need to come with new content. Well, this is my way. I'm going to have a better space in every month. You know, it can get actually really demoralizing. You know, you need to replenish okay. your members. Thank you very much, Edmund. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't worry, because what I'm going to explain here will be in greater detail right now. Okay? You know, people go to those high end hotels and all that, and they, they're going to pay 10 times more than you. They go to some high end events, and they're not going to get what I'm going to show you in a while. Say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> so, without, without further ado, alright, let's go to the specifics now. Now, this part, I'm going to warn you all. This is a part where a lot of people fall asleep, but this is also the part where. <laughs> the goal really is. But don't worry, I'll keep you entertained with some stories every now and then so that you can absorb it better. Because if it's too technical, some more put us super. Correct? Yeah. Yes. Story easier to understand. Yes. So every now and then I'll entertain you a little bit. If I have to joke with you, I'll go for it. Okay? So, anyways, why have a membership site? Uh, very obvious, so we'll be talking about it. We generate stable, predictable income every single month for work done only once. So just a curly, get paid over and over again. Now, I know this one sounds very much of me, please, I Actually, there's a way to do it once. If I show you later, then you know why. In Malaysia, okay, why? One more reason why I'm showing you continuity in income secrets is this. Okay, imagine this is Malaysian population. Huh? Based on a 2007 survey, So that means half of Malaysia is households are making three thousand one and below. If you convert this to US dollar, how much is this? Less than one thousand. Okay, I just put one thousand US dollars. Senang lah, easier. Yes. One thousand. This is also USD one thousand. All right. Now I think this is set. Agree? Set to do. I don't think it changed a lot today. This is uh, 2007, but I don't think it changed a lot today. Okay? Uh, Peter Mike Carpenter City. Siapa buat business? Siapa suka Mike Carpenter? We know you're an internet marketer already. <laughs> huh? Always convert to US dollar how much money you make. <laughs> okay? Now uh, let's just say you want to beat the average Malaysian household alone. Okay? And you charge 20 US dollar for a monthly membership site. At least one person joining 20 US dollar. How many members do you need? If you charge 20, 20 USD. I got the answer here. 50. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna tell you. Come someone to do the do a quick calculation. 50. 50, okay good. You only need 50 members. 50 members? And you beat this for really yeah. alone. Huh? We are not talking about you working as a family, no? we're talking about you working alone. Mm -hmm. Alright? Okay. You need to find 50 members. My presentation is not about showing you how to get 50 members, it's about showing you how to get hundreds of them. Mm -hmm. oh, hundreds, or ratos, ratos. That membership site you saw just now, yeah, I'm going to show you about. That one got more than 500 plus members already, paying every month. And I have three sites like that. <coughs> that is the best site I have so far, but results are more or less like that. Lah. Right? <laughs> so, 
Why build membership site? Also authority and reputation lah. Because you semua pernah dengar apa tu newsletter kan newsletter? Yeah. If you want a newsletter, what happens? You can just go in. Let's like say I join somebody's uh, newsletter and uh, katakan lah, I'm super dia or whatever he said, and I just have to click on the button and I get out. Yeah. You lose just like that. Now it's okay to still have a mailing list, but you want to build another level of of uh, uh, bias who are loyal to you. That means they buy from you all the time. Yeah. Okay, you don't want to just come and go. And time freedom, ah, tak payah tahu lah, sudah tahu kan ni. Once you get it, you know it. Yes. Okay, now, generally speaking, I found out from my mistake I told you before, there are two types of membership site. Perpetual, and what's the other word? Fixed term. Fixed term. Sekali lagi? Fixed term. Fixed term. Fixed term. Mesti semangat sikit, mau mau buat banyak duit, mesti semangat. Yeah. Yeah. Energy attracts money. <laughs> Energy attracts wealth. I had to pay four thousand sing dollars to find that. Thank <laughs> Okay. Serious kid, serious kid. Now, perpetual membership is like most websites. Are. You just pay, you just keep joining and pay every month. If you want to get out, you just cancel, correct? Yeah. yeah. Fix them is different. Fix them is, has a limited time frame. That means, I offer you, let's just say I make an offer to you right now, you join my uh, fan club, lah, okay? No. Fan club, because I don't know, lah. Uh, let's just say you join a fan club, lah, okay? My fan club, and I say that it will last for only 24 months, alright? For $10 a month. Oh, that's cheap. <laughs> okay? So, when you are informed of the decision, you know that you can stay for up to 24 months, alright? There's no uh, dealing forever. So, people, psychologically speaking, from what I found out, People are more responsive and they stand, tend to stay if they find out that they have a time limit for their subscription. Compared to this one, here's like, I don't know long, I feel like leaving at 3 months long. So, and now everyone leaving at 3 months. Okay? Now, I'm giving you a very short version of the story because when I did it alone, I found out all the reasons <coughs> why. But just trust me on this, okay? Uh, how many years of failing and that? Quite a few, alright? Just trust me on that. My recommendation is that you go fix them. Okay? I tell you why. Higher retention rate, the one I just mentioned just now. That means normally people will stay more than three months, usually. 80% of them will stay with you for more than three months if you do your membership site correctly. Number two, if you know that your membership site lasts for 24 months, for example, you just create content for 24 months right now. That means you don't have to keep doing it every single month. Alright? You just do it once, and obviously, since you already uh, predicted this is going to happen, you can automate it. Alright? Stuck on this, Mopaha? Nanti saya tanya. Alright. So higher retention rate, you only need to work once. That's why I say just now you make money every month for work done only once, right? Ah, ini lah cara dia. I will show you an example of my website later. Don't worry. So I'm going to give you the step by step. First step, you got to plan your your term. Now this number is seen here right now. Is the recommended length, lah. All right. I don't. I don't recommend to wait three months, six months, or, or anything in between because uh, not worth your time and effort actually. All right. So do twelve or twenty-four or twenty-six months. You gotta make it clear. Membership content requirements. You know when you're creating the content for your site. Uh, what's more important is your topic. You need this is more important. And I got a whole list here. Uh, you want to list or you want to send to you? Oh. Send to you. You know what I tell you what? Actually, I hesitate to give you all my slides uh, because number one, uh, like, like Zami had mentioned just now, this is actually a selling product outside. So you get this as like a blueprint to my, my course here actually. <laughs> I tell you what, I give you a couple of minutes to just write down the list. So this, 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 this is my research on it. I did all the, the topics. This topic you're seeing here right now is non time sensitive. That means when you do your content in advance for 24 months, right? You don't have to worry about whether the world will change later or the things will change later. Just like dating. The timing of dating today and the timing of dating two years later won't change, right? <laughs> <laughs> so no matter when your member join, whether you join in 2013, next month or next year, 
it's not going to be the same one. You see? But if you go and take topics like Forex, uh, gold, silver, dinar, dirham, these kind of topics, right? Uh, a bit hard because it's uh, volatile and changing all the time. Uh, so you will basically the idea is that you want to take things that don't change throughout time. Public speaking, how you speak today and how you speak two years later, not, not going to change much. Unless you, you start adding those words out like swag and go. Weight loss technique also doesn't change, but I still burn fat in the end. <laughs> okay, I just keep on walking here. Okay. <laughs> Wellness considers health. Yep. Wellness, health. Kesehatan. The organs. Ah, the content. The content. The topic. Okay. I can move on. Yeah. Now. Once you've got your topic already, the next thing is how to get the content. All right. Since we already established you're going to do 12 months or 24 months, right? You might as well work, do the work in advance right now, so that you don't have to worry about it ever again. I'll give you a few methods of survival what's in the Okay. I'm not going to tell you method one what's in the that, That's not part of the method. Actually, I don't recommend you do your own self, actually, because it's a waste of time. Preferably use your time to go and market better. Alright? I mean last time if you I mean you got no choice, you got no not much money or what then yeah like what to do DIY all the way lah. Tapi kalau ada peluang, you don't DIY lah, you might as well get get the thing done for you. DIY method. Alright, mm -hmm. okay, show you three three things here. It's not part of the slide, it's not part of the program actually, but just for your info lah. You all know DIY already, right? Yeah. Then you know what? This one, DWI. No, <laughs> no not do it yourself. <laughs> now, this, this is DIY to do it yourself. Yeah. Slow way. What's DIY is the way? Do you do what you do? Do what you do with you. That means you try mental. Okay? This one is very slow way. If <coughs> avoid this lot, okay? Then there's another one. DFY. Done for you. Done for you. Exactly. Done for you. Right. <coughs> a lot of people, you ask people outside, they already know DIY, DIY, they don't know this too. If you don't know this too, cannot be a businessman. I'm serious. If you don't know this too, you cannot be a businessman. Or a businesswoman for the matter. If you DIY all the way, you'll be a self employed forever. Pay another expensive cost for that. That's why I say you all banyak untuk hari ini. I'm very glad you all came here rather than those uh, charama and all that. <laughs> but no offense, I mean, tak kira your political stance out, okay? We, we put it aside for now, whether you mau ubah ke tau bas, what you Okay, whether you mau ubah ke bas, okay? You serious, uh, let me just be honest with you all. I see my Facebook people say mau ubah ke mau ubah ke mau ubah ke Okay, I faham. Okay, I also share your opinion, but the thing is, you want to have a better Malaysia, you got to change yourself up. Huh? Correct. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, everyone very excited to Uba government. They go put their Facebook, this government is bagus, this party is bagus. But when they talk about themselves, they are all very quiet. They don't know Uba TV. You want to make a lot of money online? You want to be a businessman? You want to be a usaha on the internet? Uba TV. Yeah. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. 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 Okay, let's say like, government is very bagus. Lah. You think your property, the one will change, just now I wrote. Tadi, tadi tu Zami dan Reza already give the reading just now. So back to our topic here. These are the formats that you normally expect to deliver in a ten or a membership. This is a bit too technical. I won't cover so much. But I think semua faham ini, right? This one PDF download or MP4 video. Yes. That means when they enter your membership site, this is the format you give them. Very easy. Or you can combine all of them. Like me, I like to combine MP4 and PDF are my favorite. MP3, personally, not so much. Lah, but you want to go in. So, chara-chara like, one is private labeling. 
Have you heard of private insurance before? Yes. yes. Oh, jadi tak payah explain lah. <laughs> okay, I tell you what, I just give a refresher. Partly because I make a lot of PLR myself. <coughs> PLR is basically the rights to take over an existing content. Katakan lah, okay, I'm not gonna PLR his book or else he sue me. <laughs> okay, you take an existing content, I say you need to cover or whatever. And then, uh, let's say somebody sells me the private label rights, so I can change the name to an untitled. <coughs> My name, and I can change the content. Basically, I got the, the rights to edit the, the content. All right. There are a lot of this kind of uh, contents floating out there. You can buy and then rebrand for yourself. So you straight away, rather than write from scratch, you just buy, change a bit, and click under your. <coughs> All right. Method two. This one's a bit more work intensive, but you deliver a lot of value. You interview experts. So let's just say you have 24 months of content, you deliver once a month, you find 24 months. <coughs> okay? But, uh, well, 24 is a little bit, a lot of work. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. Even if you interview 6 in advance, that buys you time. You don't have to do all 24 months of content straight away or 12 months, you know. You just do like 6 months first, then you market, and then you have 6 months of uh, resting period because the auto responder is sending the content to your members every month. But personally, my, my personal style, I like to finish all one shot because uh, I get I tend to get lazy later. Kalau you macam saya, you akan balas nanti ya, lebih baik buat sekali semua sekaligus. Better one shot. I mean, I get lazy so really. If I see that, I get myself six months and I just start resting. Huh? I'll be sorry, remember come to the six months. Huh? That's it, that's my content. <laughs> Alright? So another one is interview experts. Method three. Okay, this one is considered uh, DIY actually, but if your topic is very specialized and you don't trust the content out there you want to buy, you do your own research in your own uh, in your own way. What I do is that this is what I learned from uh, Tim Ferriss. <coughs> what I do is that I'll read the top three books in a certain topic, and then I will <coughs> summarize it in twenty points or so. How many points does it matter? But me, I like twenty. Uh, right, I like twenty, and then that will be my content already. There's a saying, uh, I don't know whether this is a Chinese saying or what, but it sounds like a Chinese saying uh, because China likes to copy stuff. Mm. Huh. Mm. Copy from one work is plagiarism. Mm. Yeah. Copy from server is called research. But it's true. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, metaphor hire a writer or audio or video maker. This one, you pay someone else to do it. So these are some sites, like Elance or Word Forum, both are used to, are uh, quite okay. Now, let's just say you're not ready to find uh, those uh, people on the internet. What I do is that I look for college students as well, because they are very smart and uh, can afford them. I don't want to use the word cheap or else they might get offended. Another one is referral. Uh, referral means like uh, you ask a friend of a friend, uh, but does he or she know anyone who can? Uh, uh, write for you or things like that. Okay, so these are four methods. Okay. Okay. So so far, everyone okay? Yeah. Huh? Okay. Now this is another important part. This is a more technical one. I cannot show you like the WordPress and all that right now because it is taking up the rest of the time. But you can find this on YouTube easily. How to set up WordPress and all that. Okay. For me, it's very easy. Membership sites that a lot of people do always invest in expensive trip. Last time I paid <coughs> seven hundred to nine hundred dollars for a membership trip to do all the funky mula mula stuff. Okay, and uh, even though it's very funky, but it made me very broke because I didn't get the members I wanted. My method this time is very simple. You only need to use a free WordPress trip. You don't need any plugins. Not not the paid plugins. Huh? You only need a PayPal account. And auto responder counting. Paper semua ada. Ada. Ah, siapa tak ada paper kau? Tak ada langsung. Semua ada. Kata you segan saja. Semua tak ada orang kata kan. Okay, but all all have paper kau no. And this premium personal tak kira personal is more for shopping only. You have to upgrade premium very easy. You just one, one click away, but you'll be under your actual name, like uh, Edmund, Edmund Lowe. 
a side story. Uh. My, my name is banned in PayPal, by the way. Oh. <laughs> because they, I was making a lot of sales one time from a launch. They thought I was doing something illegal, like some kind of pyramid scheme. My name got blacklisted and they kept my money. Until now? Uh, a lot uh, to me at the time. <laughs> to me, 1,700 US dollars was a lot of money at the time. Uh. Uh, but luckily, I paid all my affairs and I took some money for myself. The, the other 60,000 is okay. <laughs> <laughs> But it was, it was a lot of money at the time. Permanently limited. Yeah, permanently limited. But what they do is they return the money 180 days later. So, ah, I lose my life. But I do. <laughs> but don't worry, if you're not doing uh, anything too risky, you should be fine. Okay, so autoresponders, more than that. Autoresponder. So, what are the autoresponders now? One, two. Okay, I'll give you my feeling in the wallet. Eh? <laughs> I tell you what, autoresponder, you use either uh, AOI word or uh, you get response. It is a lot the price is about the same round. But I'll give you an honest assessment right now because I use both this account. Uh, I think AWeber is better. <laughs> I think AWeber is better right now because uh, get response has a delivery issue. That means not oh, 100% of people will sign up, not all of them end up on your list. I think they haven't fixed that issue until now. Okay. Hello. Hello. So, WordPress script, you know what you can get? No. Or Google. <laughs> okay, but these are the three essentials you need. Okay. Alright. Okay. Now the technical setup, I can't show you like how to do it like, right away, but I'll show you an example of my side right now. So okay, I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna demonstrate. Okay, if you go to one of my websites right now, there's this site called plgomonthly.com. This was the first site I created in this model I'm showing you right now. And by far the most successful as well. I'm happy to tell you that. So what you have here is my sales letter as usual. Alright? Alright, as you can see, uh, any memo good now. Actually like huh? People actually like it. You mean Bohong? Uh -uh. Oh, yeah, but you have a I mean, I can add one more figure here, you still believe me. <laughs> I paid it, this one, I swear to God, it's true. Yeah. Okay? And he got no problem, it's still true. <laughs> <laughs> Alright? But, okay, I'm not, showing, I'm not here to show you the income, uh, whatever, la, okay? But at least you know that uh, I'm not a noob. La. <laughs> okay? But what I want to draw your attention to is the last part. Of the, the letter. Okay? 2997 a month. You just remember this price for now, 2997. Huh? I got something to show you later. Okay? And you notice here, there's a small note over here. I think I'll just highlight it out for you. Notice, your money purchase is for 12 months only. After 12 months, your subscription will stop and you no longer be built. People are very happy to hear that. Yeah. <laughs> Even I'm providing value, but people are very happy to hear that. If I do this, like, if I did put this line here, I think uh, my conversions would drop up. Uh. Okay? So, put put a fixed term, man. Don't worry, like, I'd rather... Which one you want? You want people to pay for 3 months or you want people to pay for 12 months? Uh, 12 months, uh, 12 or 24 or 36, uh, but not 3 months, uh, okay? Pay for 3 months. Uh, could you talk around and At least they pay you on time. <laughs> okay. Now, this is the members area right now. So if you go to peagomonthly.com slash members, uh, you see that this is set up in a WordPress, uh, WordPress uh, theme. It's all free, including the plugins, like this, uh, well, okay. <laughs> yeah, you're there. All right, quite, quite a simple website, actually. All right, so let's just say, you go to the starter package, you're wondering how people access the content, right? You see, this is password protected. WordPress already has it. I know it's not fancy. It's not like those what must have username and password. This is only asking for a password, right? Yeah. The members will get the password from the autoresponder. 
Okay, I tell you what, I'm going to draw a little bit right now. Uh, fortunately, I can't remember the password right now, or else I don't mind giving you a free bonus here. Terlalu banyak password. I mean, the more websites you create, you can't remember everything. Like you know, you don't. You tahu kan? Not supposed to use the same password for everything. If you do that, you better go back home and change. Tell you what, I just show you the structure in the nutshell. Do you understand what's going on over here? Yes. Just now it's a search update, sorry. Yes. Okay, so after a person buys, right, it goes to a download page, thank you page up. Now most membership sites, they start sending straight to the members here, ask for your username and password, and very, all the high tech for the second century stuff starts coming in, right? Mine very simple. Thank you page, I ask for a name and email. Yeah. Okay? Yes. Ask for your name and your email. I will redirect you to the page you saw just now. This one you see. Check your email. Alright? Mm -hmm. You check your your inbox for the welcome letter. In the welcome letter, you got your password over there. Then you can enter. You don't need to spend eight, nine hundred dollars. <laughs> Okay, now the question people ask is why so easy? Why not? What if it's too perceived as low, low value? And second, why people share the password? Number one, people don't, from what I found out, people don't really care about the arrangement because it's actually not simpler. And number two, if people want to share your thing away, nothing is stopping them. Up. I can give you my username and password right now also if, if, I, if I want to share something. Total. Yeah. Yeah. Kalau mau share, jangan share, share, jangan tak share. Dan itu dia, dia juga kan dia juga so. You see, so it doesn't stop thievery. You see, you cannot stop people from from sharing content away. But normally, from my experience, again, they already pay the money. They're not going to do that lah. I say ninety five percent of them they do do that. Speaking from ages of experience, lah, they don't do that lah. The most they do also they probably share with their business partner. Takkan you want to charge your business partner also, right? Maybe the two of them working together in the same company. You want, to, you want to chase them also. Be Allah, be let her, be beyond Malaysia, for good quality. For good reason, for good reason. Okay? I mean, we have the Akopon Mole attitude. Uh, sometimes we also have our benefit actually. Uh, because we do this with uh, uh, those uh, uh, people from other countries, and uh, they are going to be meticulous with the details. Try working with Americans, I tell you, want to sign a legal agreement partnership with your company, and uh, the, the clause are all in like, Indian language. I think I understand Egyptian more than I understand the other. Breaking it up. Okay. Takani, super faham ah? Yes. Okay. This one I didn't show my slide because it's much easier if I show it to you here. Okay. So I can continue, ah? Super faham ah sekarang. Sikit-sikit. Sikit-sikit. Tak apa. At least you are honest. The rest of you will say faham. I'm gonna ask you, ah? Now by, now by. Now this is the interesting part. So far, I only show you the technical aspect. All right. Now I'm going to show you the strategy and the marketing aspect.
So far here is more of the, just I show you the engine, right? right. <coughs> so this is the back end area, right? Hey, by the way, uh, how's your technical skills? How many of you are basic HTML? You can create web websites, hands up. Any uh, other uh, Half of you. The others? Separate Tata, create website, Tata, uh, HTML, this is what I'm And Tata. Okay, 40%. So, how do you all make your websites? WordPress. WordPress. Oh, how about the rest of you? Okay, Okay, I just want to know where you are at. Because no point, I just keep carrying on, carrying on. If this is out of your league, uh, no point. I try to keep it as simple as uh, possible. Okay, but WordPress is the way to go. As long as you know how to click the thing and install, you're good to go already. Okay, I'll tell you what, I recommend you something else. Those here, Pandai, uh, what websites in India, I give you one resource. <sighs> oh, I remember my favorite thing. This one right here. This one is good, very nice. OptimizePress.com. This one you have to pay uh, 97 US dollars. But it's good because you can use this to create your sales letter, your streets page, your bonus page, whatever, all in WordPress. So you don't need to know any uh, techno or mojo stuff. Alright? Very, very uh, uh, convenient, easy to use if you don't know how to use coding and whatever. Optimize press. Okay. How to sell your membership by the hundreds? Now, this is the exciting part. Because this one is all the engines and all that. First of all, strategy, your membership pricing. I'll just spare you the, the story I'll tell you as it is. Lah. You want to charge 37 dollars above and all that, uh, those days are over. Because those uh, overseas gurus have uh, spoiled the market. Long story short, lah. I mean I know the drama, I know the politics, lah, but they spoiled the market lah, and people don't trust anymore. I'm not saying 37 dollars a month totally cannot, but you need to work really, really hard to give deliver value to earn 37 dollars a month every month. That means you have to sell soap to the devil sometimes. I don't think we all want to do that, right? You sell your soul away, there's nothing left. Okay? So, we want to go for easy, achievable, and live life stress free. Okay, so, tell you what, my recommendation you price your membership $20 a month or below. That means like 5 or 10. Alright? Now, just now I show you to your 997, my pricing just now, right? Uh, you just hold on to that thought for now. From, my, from what I found out, members tend to stick with you very long, more than three months. All right, so just take my word on this. You price twenty dollars a month and people are from below. I know it does seem a lot, but we want to sell this. The tactics to go volume, to volume correct? To, but by the jumla, okay, volume. So you see, the fact is, right? I tell you what, what my mistake I did last time. You know this traffic here? Yeah. <coughs> here upper traffic, uh, even if it's a proper traffic also, uh, there's a problem with it. If you sell this, um, this sale letter directly, right, you won't get a lot of sales, usually. <coughs> Who knows the, what is considered a good conversion rate for a sales letter? Anyone know? Anyone want to give a shot at this? Oh, zombie top of the job. He knows already. He knows already. He knows the answer already. What? 5%. 5%. Okay, he says 5%. Anyone else got a different opinion? 3. 3. 3. Okay. Anyone else got another opinion? Oh, 3 of, three to 5 now, okay? I tell you at least your highest are 5. Okay? 5%. Huh? Let's say 5% on the jury, which I think is quite, quite good to deal on. Alright? This is still considerable actually. You send all the traffic, you only get 5%. So what happened to the other 95% of traffic is wasted. And uh, it's harder to convert people actually. So my tactic is, you don't want to sell this, you don't want to send the traffic here directly. Don't do that. Instead, I propose you do something else different. 
you do five percent I tell you or you are get hundred members or you to take a long time on. Maybe some of you a few years later uh, uh, yeah, not, not that bad uh, but it could be better. Okay, kita mau kerja rajin boleh. Mesti kerja pandai juga. Must work smart, you work hard on your money enough one. My suggestion, you don't go and send the traffic in already, you create one more page first. This is not a space page, by the way. Something else. Okay? I'm going to write this, map call, I call this membership site so you'll know what this is. Here you have a What's this called? Front end. Do you know what a front end is? Yes. Oh, what's it? Can you explain to us what a front end is? <laughs> explain to us what a front end is. Front end is uh, the first page you need if you go to for, with the website. Oh, okay. This was also the first page just now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you are right. This was a front end. It was a front end. Okay, what more is I say is correct. A front end is not be the first offer that you visit to, correct? Okay, this used to be a front end, right? We created another front end over here. Okay. So this front end usually you want to price it low as well. Why price it low? Because we want to get more people to buy from you. You price it anywhere from seven dollars minimum, but you price it less than that, affiliates are not are more reluctant to promote for you. Seven dollars to twenty-seven, somewhere like that. Alright? My recommended price range. And you want to go for volumes. Here, since this is a one-time payment, it is not unrealistic to expect that the fifty percent conversion rate, if you do it correctly, okay. Unfortunately, I do not have a lot of time to share on copywriting, which is another thing I've been doing for years as well. But uh, I hope that the other future speakers will help me cover copywriting. Copywriting is a very important skill, okay. So if you do your, your sales letter properly and it's a fantastic offer, no brainer, you can expect this conversion compared to 5% over here. I'll show you something fantastic. Now let's just say you send all the traffic here. You get 10 to 15% conversion. Even at 10% doesn't matter. Before they go to your download page, you show them a one-time offer. <coughs> Who doesn't know what a one-time offer is? Siapa tak tahu apa tu one-time offer? Siapa tahu apa tu one-time offer? Everyone, ah, uh, okay. So I don't need to explain to you what a one-time offer is, ah. Uh. Hey, tak boleh sekarang tahu. If you don't know, I have to just let it go. Kalau sekarang sekarang, tak begini, ah, rugi, rugi. Then we get and then. <laughs> Actually, it was very funny, you know? Those who run it are those people who are not willing to pay anything. <laughs> those are the people I did not. No offense to those guys, are because.